Now to begin with, I'm gonna be talking about the hardware of this mouse. And on the top, it has a very nice premium slippery plastic. And on the side, it has a nice soft finish plastic. And where the buttons are in between, in the middle of all of them, there's a nice rubber where you can lay your thumb. The mouse is not very big or very small. It's more medium sized and in my opinion it's a perfect fit for most people including myself the buttons on this mouse are also uh, very high quality as well and very clicky and i have not run into any issues or uh, them breaking down this is also a very attractive mouse and it has really nice colorways coming in green and red i have the red one as you can see it's almost like an iridescent color and it's very reflective. The design of the mouse is very unusual and unique and definitely a head turner. On this mouse there are lights on the scrolling wheel, buttons on the side, and the Razer logo on top. And I would like to add that the quality of the cable with the mouse is very good. It's a knitted material and I've had no issues with it breaking or having laggy connections because of it. Overall, this mouse has a great build quality and I've had no issues with anything breaking or just not working all of a sudden. Now, another important part of the mouse is its handling. And this one is very smooth at moving when using it. This mouse is a little on the lighter side, but it's not super light. It has a decent weight to it that I prefer and it comes in at 135 grams. And be aware that it does not support any added weights. When scrolling with the scrolling wheel, it scrolls very smooth and has a nice weight to it. It comes with a Razer Precision 3.5G laser sensor, which I have found to be very accurate and precise. You can also disable the side buttons from inputting numbers by the switch on the back. Overall, it's very ergonomic and very comfortable to use, even hours at a time. But unfortunately, it is only a right-handed mouse. The two skinny buttons under the scrolling wheel can be used as a forward and back button in browsers and in certain applications. It works with the Razer Synapse software where you can program all 11 buttons for whatever you want to use it for, including the six side buttons. Here you can also change the mouse's DPI from 100 to 5600 DPI, giving it a very wide range. For how sensitive you want your mouse to be. Here you can also set up multiple profiles and configurations with uh, programming of mouse buttons and the DPI and all that good stuff. Overall I do think this is a good mouse. It has great hardware but it is older and it's not as updated as some mouses today. It has a gorgeous beautiful design but um, it is very expensive and it is very hard to get so I do not think this is the best mouse for the average person but for someone that likes collecting or someone that uh, really likes the design and wants to stand out then this can be a great mouse it is also a very good gaming mouse and a very good everyday mouse if you've enjoyed then like this video and if you like to see this type of content then subscribe also if you have any questions then leave them down below in the comment section i hope you've enjoyed